It's something the kids at Blessed Sacrament School do every year, making desserts for the rescue mission. But this year, there's an added touch, helping the homeless in more ways than one. New Channel 9's Julia LeBlanc spoke with those involved about why this season is so very special. A tradition of two decades. Getting it stirred? Very good. Students at Blessed Sacrament School making more than 100 pies for the annual Thanksgiving dinner at the rescue mission. Can you go ahead and dump it right in? Learning what it takes to feed around 800 people and doing it all together, taking a little piece of their home and bringing it to those who may not have one. Just being present to the kids and um, hopefully encouraging them um, that what they do here, that they will continue to do it at home and throughout their lives. These pies will provide more than half of the desserts at the dinner, something the rescue mission really can't do without. Thanksgiving at the rescue mission is a really special time, and we like to treat it as such. And we really consider the folks that we serve as part of our extended rescue mission family. On top of baking the pies, the kids are also wearing these rainbow socks in support of the company Sock Out Cancer. Each color represents a different type of cancer, and they'll be giving these to the rescue mission to keep them warm as well. They're probably like sad, like because they have cancer and they have to go through a lot of treatments and stuff, which has probably brought them down. And you have to make them happy because everyone deserves a chance to be happy. Quinn Iskander is the one who wanted more than 20 schools in the area to wear these socks. And Support of those battling cancer, whether the socks will be keeping people warm or warming their hearts. She wants everyone to know they're cared for, bringing the reason why all these kids are here full circle. That they have gifts to share, and I hope they can share their gifts always. Thinking of others during the holiday season. Julia LeBlanc, News Channel 9. And we're told that at 10 tomorrow morning, 22 Catholic schools in the area will take a moment to say a prayer for those fighting cancer. They will also be wearing those sock-out cancer socks.